the world's largest auction house, Christie's International, planning to open its first office in Russia. Now its rival, Sotheby's, opened a branch in May. As Anna Parashkovova found out, economic growth is driving the demand for art. Art for the sake of art, or money. Rinaldina Vlasova has been a connoisseur of art for the last seven years, but she has recently become the owner of Impressions Gallery Shkola, or school, the first one of its kind in Russia. Rinaldina says art can be an excellent way to make a living in Russia these days. Russians now have the financial means to buy art. Businessmen who don't have anything to do with art have started buying works. It has become interesting for them and even a bit fashionable. The biggest sale so far reached $8 million. Some of the paintings exhibited at the gallery include Monet's and Renoir's. That's increasingly what Russian art lovers want, along with Russian and modern art. As Russia's economy continues to grow for a ninth consecutive year, so does the number of its billionaires. But in addition to fancy cars and expensive homes, the country's rich are now craving art. And some of the world's largest auction houses are ready to give it to them. Christie's International is planning to open an office in Moscow by the end of the year, although it is yet to decide on the location. Christie's sales of Russian art increased sevenfold from 2000 to 2006. In the first half of 2007 alone, the auction house sold 69 million worth of Russian art worldwide. But buyers abroad tend to be Russian expats, according to collector Andrei Yaromin. He says Russia's fast-paced growth has created a new generation of art collectors. The majority of old collectors are not wealthy people and buying works at auctions is very expensive for them. For new collectors, businessmen who've made a lot of money, that's not a problem and recent auctions have shown this. Basically, there is no price that can now scare Russian buyers. But while we plead with wealthy buyers, the Russian art market still has to win their trust. Russians are still not used to buying such masterpieces of international importance in a gallery. This perhaps shocks a bit. Some people don't know enough. They hesitate or have doubts. Christie's Moscow branch will focus on recruiting new clients and arranging private sales, but will not hold auctions. Anna Prashkivova, Russia Today.